Hi everyone, welcome to Fan Life Fan Gaming, and today we are in Wales. So for the past two days, we have been here in Penman Point, which is a lovely place to stay. If you're lucky, in winter you might see the Northern Lights or Aurora Borealis, and also you might see bioluminous algae in the ocean, which will light up the ocean. Another thing that you would see here, if the ocean is flat enough, you would see some dolphins poking their little heads up and going back down. But we have not seen any of those here today, or for the past two days. But what we have seen is in the calf, we've got some lovely, cute doggos. Two of them, to be fact, the son and the mum. And they would even come and play with you. You have to pay seven pounds £7.50 for the night and £7.50 for the day. And look at this. This is the shadow, the son of the mother. Hold on. Take it, boy. <laughs> we even gave them a toy. basically going to try and stay here the night this place is lovely but the only thing is that it has no signal whatsoever it is beautiful but we have no signal so i don't know what we're going to do we're probably going to use it's one of our devices that we can just watch movies on without internet i'll see you guys in a minute peace out Right guys, so here we are about to get on our boat, the Dreamcatcher, to go see or try and see some dolphins. I will record some videos for you guys on the boat, so don't you worry, and we'll also be taking pictures. so many dolphins we even saw a baby dolphin which was less than a year old the people on the boat said which was incredible and they kept coming out of the water and when we come, came off the boat we even saw a dolphin jump out of the water how exciting is that right guys this is 
is where we've been staying in Ukraine. We've got a lovely spot here. And we got here at 6 in the morning so we could try and get the best spot, which I think that worked really well. It was It was £4.20 for the whole day to stay here, but we're not allowed to stay here overnight. That's why we came here at 6 in the morning. So now we're going to head off to our new destination, and I'll see you guys when we get there. I might do some b-roll, I might not. Let's find out on the way. Right guys, so last night we stayed here at Pendime Beach. It's a lovely sandy beach and it costs 15 pounds to stay here the night you are allowed to camp here which is amazing so this is what we stayed last night and if you didn't know that they used to bring their motorbikes and motor cars around here because it's so smooth and they used to race Right guys, so today we are stealth camping at Langwit, Langwit Major and I think we should be alright because there are other vans but one thing we haven't shown you is our van in stealth mode. Let me show you it. Right, so here you can see that we've got barely any lights showing through, so that's also how you know that it's not really a camper van. Right guys, so that was our time here at this place. This place is really nice and it's starting to rain so i think we might as well make our way up the coast a bit more and if there's not really any places we want to stop because we're leaving tomorrow leaving wales or oh, we'll leave wales today we might head our way to stonehenge i think we are leaving wales today so we will go to stonehenge i'm guessing right guys so this is the end of the wales trip if you'd like us to go there again, let us know. So these are my thoughts and feelings about what I really thought of the trip. So these are my likes. I liked that there was friendly dogs and I loved the amazing Excellent views that you could see. This was absolutely magical for me because I've never really seen this in the UK before. But the dislikes is that camp fans aren't really welcome there. And like we found it really hard to find someone to stay, which I really didn't like. Another thing I didn't like is 